Welcome to our special on the Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival. For a number of years, Autofocus has been holding test drive festivals where automakers and distributors showcase their latest and best models and offer them for test drives to the public in a single venue. The annual event has been successful in bringing together would-be car buyers and automotive sellers in a common venue where options can be compared and test-driven. With the added benefit of special deals for serious buyers and info on where to go for and how to get financing. SUVs against SUVs against SUVs. Sedans versus sedans versus sedans. MPVs. Crossovers. Vans. American brand. Japanese brand. Korean. Chinese. The convenience offered by the festival led to the event being held in the middle of the two peak buying seasons for vehicles, the Summer Festival and the Pre-Christmas Festival. The COVID-19 pandemic put the festivals on hold for a couple of years. But as health restrictions eased, the Autofocus Summer Test Drive Festival returned to its old haunts at the Mall of Asia concert grounds. It was like a dam leaking and then breaking. It started slow but soon people came out over the four days of the Summer Festival to check out the latest cars in the market. People who've delayed plans to buy their first cars, upgrade to bigger and better ones, owing to the uncertainties brought about by the pandemic, came to the festival to narrow down choices. Car enthusiasts also came out to just enjoy checking out and driving the latest in the market. At the festival were the latest from Shangan, GAC, Geely, Isuzu, MG, Mitsubishi, Nissan, Suzuki, and Toyota. The turnout at the Summer Festival served to confirm what many hope to see in 2022. The automotive sector, indeed the nation, finally seeing a return to normalcy. A new normal, if you will. The turnout also served to show that a sequel would be a good idea. Stay tuned, we'll return with the Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival. At the core of Toyota Gazoo Racing lies motorsports DNA. Combine that with the Philippines' best-selling sedan, you get the Vios GRS. Its black accent details and aero kit upgrade capture the feel and excitement on the track, and the 10-speed CVT that exudes the TGR competitive spirit. On the road or on the track, always be ready for a heart-racing exhilarating ride. The Vios GRS. Bring on the thrill. Transcend your business with the Isuzu Travis. Inquire now at any Isuzu dealership near you. Welcome back to our Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival. The auto industry has always felt that the months leading to and ending with the Christmas holidays is the time when sales are the highest. Many vehicle launches are timed to coincide with our long celebration of the Christmas holidays. This is also the time when the best deals, promos, and freebies come out. And what better way to complement those efforts? than the Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival.
There was excitement for the festival even before it opened, as participating automakers and distributors set up their booths, as showcase models were driven or trucked into the venue, as test drive units were buffed into a sheen. Nine auto brands participated in the summer edition of the festival. Eleven joined the pre-Christmas, six of them making a return to the MOA concert grounds. The eleven include Shangan, Ford, Honda, Hyundai, MG, Mitsubishi, Nissan, Subaru, Suzuki, Toyota, and WM Motor. There was a palpable festive air when the time came to formally open the 2022 Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival and a sense of optimism for a strong final season for sales. A final briefing is made to ensure an orderly and safe but still enjoyable process for festival guests to test drive their choice vehicles and hopefully reservations. The test course was ready, the booths were ready, the test units are lined up, all prepped and shiny, clean in and out, and ready for testing. When we return, after a break, we'll check out what participating automakers and distributors had in store at the festival. At the core of Toyota Gazoo Racing lies Motorsports DNA. Combine that with the Philippines' best-selling sedan, you get the Vios GRS. Its black accent details and aero kit upgrade capture the feel and excitement on the track. And the 10-speed CVT that exudes the TGR competitive spirit. On the road or on the track, always be ready for a heart-racing, exhilarating ride. The Vios GRS. Bring on the thrill. Are you into grassroots racing? Slaloms, autocross, time attacks, and circuit racing. Do you like to keep your daily ride in tip-top condition? Do you want to improve the performance and ride of your vehicle? Then head over to Fix Stop Auto Service along 91 Congressional Avenue, Project 8 in Kazan City. Fix Stop Auto Service can level up the performance and ride of your daily rider weekend racer of all brands, models, and makes from Japanese, American, European, and all other global manufacturers. Fixed Stop Auto Service offers preventive maintenance services as well as upgrades of brakes, suspension, and other mechanical works. Fixed Stop also caters to all your needs for performance tires and accessories to make your dream vehicle stand out on the road or for just your enjoyment. For appointments, call 0917-803-8283 or message us on our Facebook page www.facebook.com slash Service. Welcome back to our Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival Special. Right in the midst of the perceived peak quarter for vehicle sales, 11 automakers and distributors showcased their best and latest models, offering them for test drives to would-be buyers and car enthusiasts. Let's check out the booths and find out what is on offer for visitors and guests at the festival. Shangan booth we find its subcompact crossover, the CS35 Plus, and its larger sibling, the all-new CS55, getting a fair share of requests for test drives.
area with the vehicles bearing the blue oval, Ford Philippines Managing Director Michael Breen touts the attractions of the model lineup made available for test drives. Well, at the Ford area, customers and enthusiasts can see and test drive our next generation Ford Ranger and Ford Everest, as well as the great Ford territory, our small SUV. On the next generation Ranger, of course, the incredible new exterior and interior appearance. Also, we've just launched the Ford Pass connectivity that's built into Ranger to enhance the overall ownership experience. And in addition to that, we've got a 10 or 12 inch touchscreen, 360 degree camera, improved ride and handling, rear box step, which is a great feature to get you access to the, uh, the rear box, tailgate lift assist, and improved cargo management system. On the next generation Everest, of course, like Ranger, these exterior styling and enhanced interior. Also like Ranger, Everest is equipped with Ford Pass. It also has the 10 inch or 12 inch touchscreen, 360 degree camera, improved ride and handling, e-shifter, improved storage area, and hands-free liftgate. Now, Territory is a huge crowd pleaser with its popular appearance, panoramic moonroof, 360 degree around view monitor, blind spot information system, 10 inch infotainment system, and finally, Apple CarPlay with wireless connectivity feature and Android Auto capability. On the booth, we find slide with Honda's Maricel Kilau talking about the Japanese car makers festival attractions. And I am here at a very, very busy exhibit. We're talking about the Honda exhibit, and we have Miss Patch uh, to uh, to talk to us about the details on what is going on here at the Honda booth. So, Patch, good afternoon. Nice to see you here. Nice to see you. Thank you for allowing us to participate in this event. Well, it is our pleasure. Ang gusto namin mga for the people to really be able to have a look and feel of the different vehicles that are on display. Now, I noticed that napakarami ng mga vehicles na naka-out sa mga test drive displays nyo, no? Uh, which of the vehicles yung pinakaparating tinatest drive ng, ano, ng, ng public? Well, actually, that's a tough one. All of the vehicles are super busy. Uh, we're showcasing here our latest models, the Brio, the City, the Civic, the HRV, and the CRV. So all of them uh, pinipilahan. So we're very happy that uh, our event visitors are test driving them. Right, right. Now I'm I'm sure pinipilahan yung mga yan, and I'm sure that uh, those who have test driven the vehicles are also very happy with it. And the next thing that they would be asking about is magkano ang prices nito at meron ba tayong Christmas discount for them? Yeah, uh, we have all the details, but uh, we'd like to invite them to visit any of our 37 uh, dealerships for uh, the complete information and also to visit our website hondafield.com and uh, they can continue the test drive there in our 37 uh, dealerships nationwide. The Hyundai booth is sleek and silvery, all the better to showcase its local lineup. Sly takes shelter from the intermittent rains and chats with Hyundai's Mark Parulan. Thank God for our friends here at Hyundai. We are very, very safe from the rains that are happening here at the Mall of Asia Open Ground. So uh, we are here inside their booth right now and I'm, I'm right beside Mr. Mark Parulan of Hyundai here to talk to us about what's new and what's up and what's hot with Hyundai. So good afternoon, sir. How are you today? Good afternoon, Slide. So I'm doing well today and we're very grateful to be part of Sunshine Television Auto Focus Test Drive event once more. Right, right. They're always with us and this time around I'm looking at a lot of very, very interesting uh, technologically advanced vehicles. The, the one behind me is not the Staria, it's the Stargazer. Can you please tell me more about this vehicle, sir? Okay, the Stargazer is the latest addition to the Hyundai lineup. It's a seven-seater MPV that is equipped with Smart Sense technology, which is top of the line in terms of safety when it comes to its segment. 
Right, right. I also noticed because I've been I've been seeing this on social media. I've been I've been I've been seeing uh, new variants of, of of Hyundai vehicles all over the place. So, what are these new vehicles, and are they also available for test drive? Yes, most of our vehicles are available for test drive. So we have the Staria. We have two variants of it. We have the 11 seater and the 7 seater top of the line. We have the Hyundai Creta, and we also have the Tucson. And leading the pack once more is the Stargazer. The Test Drive Festival is billed as free Christmas, but already MG Philippines is in a gift-giving mood. Sly discovers from MG's Lynn Buena. So because we are here and we know that this is the pre-Christmas test drive, uh, people are going to be flocking in to test drive units as Christmas gifts to themselves. What do you guys have as part of their additional gift for themselves when they get their uh, units from you? Apart from the excellent chance to test drive any of our extraordinary MG cars, which is the HS, the ZST, the ZS, and the MG5, any test drive here at the Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival entitles a client to a chance to win either a PlayStation 5, wow. an Apple AirPod, wow. or an Apple Watch. Right. So you, have, you get the chance to test drive and you get a chance to win any of these great prizes. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so let's talk about what um, our our public can test drive here at your booth today. What are the vehicles that are available? Okay, we have the subcompact sedan, the MG5, big in features, uh, big in class. We also have the ZST, that's the turbocharged version of our ZS, the best-selling uh, ZS crossover SUV. We have the ZS, and also we have the compact SUV uh, MGHS, which is on display over here. Mitsubishi is proud of successes at WRC and the car endurance races, and it's drawing crowds to its booth with its rally art variants and its local lineup. I am here at the Mitsubishi booth with uh, Kevin Peters as, uh, as our resource person on what is happening here uh, in their booth. So good afternoon, sir. How are you today? Good afternoon. I'm fine. Thank you. Okay. Uh, I can tell that we've got a lot of people lining up for test drives in the vehicles. Um, what is the crowd favorite as far as uh, test driving vehicles are concerned? For now, the uh, pinaka tine test drive ngayon is the Expander model, which is the uh, new Expander 2023 uh, year model, and also the Montero Sport Rally Art, of course, and the Strada Rally Art. Right, right, right. Okay, so uh, let's talk a little bit about the Strada Rally Art, because we uh, it's that it's on a very special podium right now, and it looks quite a lot like the one in the AXCR that's going to be uh, um, uh, racing this uh, this this. Uh, Tail end of November. So, what is the deal with the Strada AXCR? Well, actually, the Strada Rally Art, which is on for test drive today, is not this one. This is the display model. So, this uh, model is the AXCR replica, which is going to compete in Thailand and Cambodia for the Asia Cross Country Rally uh, this November 21 to 26. So, we've put it here so that people can see what is uh, the AXCR replica model and what it looks like up close and personal. The car companies are certainly putting their best foot, showcase, and test drive units forward at the festival. When we return, more visits to the booths. At the core of Toyota Gazoo Racing lies motorsports DNA. Combine that with the Philippines' best-selling sedan, you get the Vios GRS. Its black accent details and aero kit upgrade capture the feel and excitement on the track. And the 10-speed CVT that exudes the TGR competitive spirit. On the road or on the track, always be ready for a heart-racing, exhilarating ride. The Vios GRS. Bring on the thrill. Who said happiness can only be found on the ground? Next generation Ford Ranger. Do the undone. Reserve yours now on Ford.com.ph or at your nearest Ford dealer.
we're back with the Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival Special and more visits to the charming booths and their hosts, not to mention the technologically advanced SUVs and sedans available for test drive. Globally, Nissan is among the pioneers of mass-produced battery-powered vehicles, and locally, Nissan wants to lead the shift towards EVs, as can be gleaned from their offerings at our festival. We have with us Mr. Mark Cruz for, uh, for Nissan to talk to us a little bit more about uh, what they have in store for you. So, good morning, sir. How are you today? I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. So, today, we have three of Nissan's latest vehicles that were launched in 2022. So, first is the all-new Kix e-Power. So, this vehicle is equipped with Nissan's e-Power technology. It is 100% electric motor-driven at all times wow. and has an onboard gasoline engine used primarily to charge the battery. Convenient, right? Yes, yeah. it's very interesting technology. And uh, yeah, you know what? Before we talk about that technology, let's let's move on with the other right, displays right. that you have. Okay. So next is the all-new Nissan Livina. It is our seven-seater family SUV, which is perfect for families, so especially moms, because it is equipped with Nissan Intelligent Mobility technology, keeping you and your family safe, no, at all times, no, and giving you a comfortable ride, no, because of Nissan's cold air conditioning. Nice, nice. Yes, we all know about Nissan's cold air conditioning. That's uh, that's been going on for at least a couple of decades now. All right, what is more? Uh, what, what, what else do we have here at your uh, your exhibit? All right. Lastly is of course the Nissan Leaf, no, which is 100% electric vehicle and has zero emissions. So we're also showcasing the V2X technology, wherein the Leaf can be used, no, to power common household items, no, such as air cons, TVs, no, uh, during power outages, no. Subaru booth Margarita Delfinado lists the lineup available for test drives as well as the technologies that make them safe and enjoyable on the road. Today, the vehicles available in our booth is of course the Subaru XB, the Subaru Forester, we also have our WRX, our Evoltes, and our Outback. We have our uh, state-of-the-art EyeSight 4.0. Subaru is the only one equipped with this kind of feature, which of course focuses on safety of our uh, customers. Suzuki booth, fun and games are provided for kids to play and win prizes. While dad and mom check out and test drive the Suzuki's fun and utilitarian vehicles. Hi car, good afternoon. Hello Slide, uh, nice to have you here in our booth. I uh, hope you feel the festive vibe already as early as now. So we're very much excited to be here once again. And yes, it is festive, not just for the adults, but for kids as well. They actually have a kids' play area here. So for uh, for mommies and daddies who can't get rid of their kids just to check out their cars, Suzuki has that answered for you. Now, uh, aside from the Suzuki Jimny, which is, again, I, I know you know this, uh, sales are off the roof. What other vehicles are available for test drive? Well, Slide, as you can see here, we have seven units on display uh, from our compact hatch down to our utility vehicle. All of these are ready for test drive. So we have seven cars on this pay for this autofocus test drive. Nice, nice. So they really came packed for uh, for, for the test drive uh, experience of our motoring public. Now, uh, let, let's talk a little bit about pricing. It's it's almost Christmas and everybody wants a little bit of aguinaldo in the form of discounts for, for, for manufacturers. Uh, what uh, promos do you have to offer our, our public? Well, for this four-day um, autofocus test drive, we have fuel vouchers uh, for our customers who would be doing some inquiries or even making a reservation during this four-day event. So, uh, fuel vouchers are very much important, especially during this holiday season. So, that's something that we offer to our customers for this activity. Toyota is making a big push for the hybrid variants in its local lineup. For the Toyota booth, our main push for this event is actually our hybrid vehicles that we would want the public to test drive and experience what is Toyota hybrid vehicle is all about. 
All right, so just in case they still don't really know what hybrid is all about, and you know, there's always that fear of new technology, I, I, I'm gonna ask for a couple of personal insights on you. I'm, I'm sure you've driven the, the hybrid vehicles. How different are they from the, you know, the standard vehicles that we, we are uh, accustomed to driving? Performance-wise, actually, hybrid vehicle doesn't differ in a regular vehicle. One key advantage of actually a hybrid vehicle is really the gas consumption. With the increasing gas prices now, really, people are moving towards hybrid vehicles to really save up on gas. For our test drive hybrid vehicles, we have four. We have Camry, RAV4, Corolla Cross, and Corolla Altis. All right, now can you, uh, if, if, if it's okay or if you have the numbers, um, how, how, how much fuel efficiency do these uh, vehicles actually have? Like, um, how many kilometers per, per liter based on uh, the, the hybrid setup of use of electronic, uh, the, the electronic engine and um, the, the, the actual combustion engine? Um, it differs per model, but if I may take, for example, one model RAV4, maybe around 20 to 23 kilometers per liter. One of the most intriguing vehicles available for testing at the pre-Christmas festival were found at the booth of WM Motors, which is placing a large bet on EVs going into the mainstream in the country. Right behind me in this booth are fully electric vehicles. Take note, fully electric. We're not talking about hybrid vehicles. We're talking about vehicles that run on electricity 100%. And with me is uh, Bobby Shaw of WM Motors. Good afternoon, sir. How are you today? Good afternoon. Good afternoon. And thank you for having us uh, at the Autofocus Multibrand Test Drive Festival. Well, it is a delight to have you guys here. Um, you. And, you know, bringing in... Fully electric vehicles is a very, very brave step for any company because uh, a, a lot of people are thinking about can Philippine infrastructure actually uh, be able to support fully electric vehicles on the road? So that's going to be my first question for you, okay? Uh, uh, every time somebody thinks about buying a car, you'll have to think about when to use it, how to use it, how to enjoy it, and then there's the whole idea of having to fuel it up every now and then. Since we're talking about electric vehicles, it's one thing to plug it into the house, but if you have to go to a certain destination, how do you guys address that problem? Okay. Uh, the thing is with the with the EV scenario here in the Philippines, it's still it's in its infancy, but we've addressed or we're trying to address the, the charging or what we call range anxiety. You have uh, home chargers, you have destination chargers, you have uh, on-journey chargers, and uh, I'm very happy to know that there are a lot of companies, local companies, who have taken that bold step similar to what we've done with the vehicle to install, to set up charging stations. First of all, maybe here in Luzon, I've heard of some groups doing it in Iloilo, in the Visayas, and uh, Mindanao. But eventually, this will all come. You know? What's the maximum range of the, the, the lineup of vehicles here? I mean, an average range uh, from 100% down to 0%. How many kilometers? For the W5, uh, the NEDC range, the new European driving cycle range, is 403. That's the official range. Of course, these are all affected by driving habits, uh, traffic conditions, heat, humidity, uh, all other factors. Shiny and bright vehicles were certainly not the only attraction at the booths when we return after this short break. Transcend your business with the Isuzu Travis. Inquire now at any Isuzu dealership near you. Motul is the most trusted motor oil of the top teams competing in some of the world's most grueling race competitions. The WRC, the WTCC, and the Japan GT. 
Motul is the only 100% fully synthetic motor oil in the market. It has antioxidation properties that prevent premature thickening and aging due to thermal stress and guarantees total engine protection. For more information about Motul engine oils, visit www.motul.com.ph. Life comes at you fast. If you're brave enough, drive right back at it. Brave the big city or the great outdoors. Brave the carpool or the extra cargo. Brave the unexpected with Honda Sensing. Brave the long road with fuel efficiency to reach your destination. The all new Honda BRV. Brave the next level. Welcome back to our special on the Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival. How did the visitors find their experience test driving their dream vehicles? What did they think about the festival giving them a chance to compare vehicles in their short list for purchase this holiday season? Slide gets us their answers. Sir, magandang hapon. Ano po pangalan lang, sir? Marvin Asunicion. Alright, sir. Uh, is this your first time driving a Shangan vehicle? Uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, oh. Actually. So, um, ano po yung nakapag-attract sa inyo dito sa vehicle na to? At ito po yung pinili niyong i-test drive dito sa test drive festival natin. Madami siyang ano, eh, nadagdag na features sa sasakyan. Kung baga, unang-una, napakalamig ng aircon niya. Pangalawa, napakalambot ng manobela. Sarap niyang i-drive. Yung suspension niya medyo stable. Higit sa lahat yung presyo. Hey, good morning, sir. What is your name? Uh, Romar. Romar, uh, first things first, uh, are you an existing Ford owner or is this your first time to... Oh, it's your first time. Okay. So, uh, can you please describe to us your experience on test driving the Ford Everest? Uh, so far, smooth naman siya. Uh, okay naman yung handling niya. So, satisfied naman. Satisfied, okay. So, ito naman yung tanong ko, sir, no? Because you were able to test drive the unit, uh, is this going to help you in choosing kung ano yung kotse na bibilhin nyo? Uh, yes, in a lot of ways, di ba? So, kasi na-experience mo na kung paano siya, at least on the road. Not just on the aesthetic, but also yung how it handles the road. So, oh. it really help. It's time for us to hear the performance of the vehicles from the Honda stable. And we've got the test driver right here. Let's go have a word with him. Hi, good afternoon or good morning, sir. What is your name, please? Paolo. Paolo, uh, are you an existing Honda owner? No, no, I'm not. So is this your first time uh, driving a Honda vehicle? No, no, no. Okay, so he borrows Honda vehicles and today he, he would like to test drive for himself. And I'm hoping that this would lead to a sale. But um, first things first, can you please describe to us uh, your experience test driving this vehicle, sir? It was too short. <laughs> it was too short, so he is looking for a lot of excitement for this vehicle. But of course, in the given in the given uh, time frame and in the given uh, uh, space that we have for the for the vehicle, what are your thoughts on the performance? It was good, and it, the car was very smooth. All right. What is your favorite feature? And we're not just talking about the engine or anything, but what's your favorite feature overall, as far as the car is concerned? Uh, I guess the overall experience was good. And I, d I don't have a special. Uh, favorite right now. <laughs> that's all right. That's all right. I think you will eventually have your favorite when you bring this vehicle home and drive it everywhere. Thank you very much for your time. Have a great day. We've got an interesting uh, car coming in. This is the Hyundai Steria, and we're going to go talk to the test driver right now. Hi, hi, hello, good morning. What is your name, sir? Herwin. And what an interesting choice of vehicle for your test drive. Why did you choose the Staria for your test drive, sir? Looking for something uh, to drive with my family. It is really a very big family vehicle, and it looks like a spacecraft from the outside. So uh, what, are, what, what are the things you noticed as you uh, took it for a spin uh, in an hour course? It's quite big <laughs> and spacious, so quite intimidating to drive, but you have all the driver aids, so I think it's it's. All right, let's uh, let, let's do a little bit of a rating here. Uh, as far as comfort and convenience is concerned, as the driver, on a scale of one to ten, how would you rate it? Uh, nine. Nine. Okay. How about safety? Do you feel safe riding and driving the vehicle? Yes. 
right. And what are the top three uh, features of this vehicle that you would remember for the days or weeks to come? Uh, well, the captain seats, the blind spot monitor, and uh, the overall spaciousness. So it is really spacious. I'm actually looking at the space. Yeah, uh, we, we can have a little party inside, right? Last question before I let you go. Did the test drive help you uh, decide further on whether you're going to get a vehicle or not? Uh, yeah, I think it's a good venue to be able to try all the brands uh, that you have so you can compare it side by side at the same time. Good morning, sir. What is your name? Hi, my name is Jenner Morales. And uh, uh, is this your first time on board an MG vehicle? It is, yes. Okay. Um, how long have you been driving, sir? Um, probably a year. What features of the car do you like the most after having test driven it? Well, this car has like sports mode. Uh, if you are into sports, like more an acceleration, this is the car for you. And uh, for like for example, you wanna put on a little bit tipid on your budget, yeah. then you can do eco mode. Ah, all right, all right, okay. But in uh, riding comfort, naman, sir, is it comfortable on board the MG? Ano po masasabi natin? Well, the first that catch my eye is this panoramic roof. Uh, it's a, a bit like you're not really in, in, into a car. Second will be the air conditioner. It's too cold here. And the steering wheel, it's giving you comfort. It's like compared to you're driving a luxury car. Hi ma'am, good morning. What is your name? Noemi. Noemi, okay, so uh, this is the first time I am interviewing somebody who is not driving but is actually on the passenger side. So uh, first things first, are you an existing Mitsubishi owner or is this your first time riding a vehicle? Uh, this is my first time riding a Mitsubishi vehicle. All right, and uh, can you please tell us about uh, how how uh, how the comfort levels are as far as your ride is concerned? Uh, the comfort level is a 10 over 10. It was nice and it's so comfortable here. Okay, that's that's good to know. So, um, malamig po ba yung aircon? Sobra po. <laughs> Sobra, nag enjoy and yeah. Sweater ako. O, buti na lang, naka-sweater si ma'am. And of course, um, ano pa yung mga ibang na-notice nyo as far as the amenities of the vehicle is concerned? The vehicle is so spacious and yung suspension na, it was so nice, hindi matagtag. So All right. comfortable talaga. Very comfortable, hindi matagtag. This is the Mirage, ladies and gentlemen. Just in case you would like to uh, test drive for yourself, well, feel free to come by their dealership. Ma'am, thank you very much for your time and we hope that you enjoy the rest of the day. Thank you. Hello, good morning, sir. What is your name, please? Uh, Kim Clark. And, uh, okay, so you are on board the Nissan Terra. Uh, what are your thoughts on this vehicle? It is a uh, very technologically advanced, like uh, the sensors in the car is uh, very good for uh, drivers all around. My, my next question would be this, why did you choose the Nissan Terra as your test drive vehicle today? And so it's for the family, uh, our family is a big one so we have to have the space and the safety features that comes with the Nissan Terra. All right, so as far as safety is concerned, you already uh, took it uh, for, for a spin. Did you feel safe driving the vehicle? Yeah, uh, because of the sensors, uh, as I've said, very responsive to uh, obstacles. All right, all right. And uh, what is your favorite feature of this vehicle? As I said, the safety features are very much, uh, very much the, the one I was looking forward to That's testing. a deciding factor yeah, for yeah. you. It's a safety feature indeed. And I'm, I'm looking at a very, very spacious cabin as well. Would you recommend this vehicle for other uh, drivers or riders as well? Yeah, especially for families, uh, big families. The space, uh, as you said, uh, is very spacious for a family of fives or seven. Hi, good morning, sir. What is your name? I'm Adrian Masangkay. I can tell that you are really so ready for this test drive because you've got your uh, your, your GoPro on your on your forehead. Okay, first things first, um, are you an existing Subaru vehicle owner? No. Okay, so is this your first time driving a Subaru? This is my second time. I've tried uh, Subaru XV recently. Right, right. And can you please tell us more about your experience on board this vehicle? It's very sporty. The gas is responsive. I like the power. It's so fun to drive. So fun. 
outside. <laughs> he wishes he could drive it outside. Well, there is that thing that uh, we could, that we can actually buy the vehicle so that we could just drive it anywhere. But uh, what is your favorite feature on board this vehicle as you went uh, went went about with our test drive course? Uh, my favorite is the engine, of course, because this is a sporty car. It's so punchy. I like right. driving it. Okay, so it's a punchy vehicle, and that is something that is going to definitely help our viewers for uh, for when they choose which car to buy. So, okay, in three words, would you please describe this vehicle? Fast, fun, and still practical. All right, fast, fun, and practical. Those are the top three words of our test driver. Thank you so much for your time, sir. I'm not going to disturb you anymore. Have a great day, all right? Thank you. So, nandito tayo ngayon sa booth ng Suzuki at meron tayong uh, test driver na nandito. And uh, mukhang sinulit niya ang kanyang experience kasi pumasok na siya doon sa loob ng course natin. Inikot pa niya sa buong Mall of Asia ang ating uh, Suzuki Jimny. Sir, maganda umaga po. Ano po pangalan niyo? Ako po si Joe Maridola. Taga saan po tayo, sir? Uh, Santa Ana, Manila. Okay. Uh, first time niyo po ba makapagmaneho ng Suzuki Jimny, sir? Ako po. First time na first time ko po ito. Okay. Ano naman po masasabi niyo dito sa ano sa vehicle na to? Ah, uh, comfortable, ah, uh, walang problema. Maganda driver, pang ride ride na uh, mong kalagala, ayan. Sir, tanong ko lang no, ah, uh, saan niyo po gagamitin ang Suzuki Jimny kasi mukha medyo mahilig tayo sa outdoors no, tsaka mahilig yata tayo sa mga out of town. Saan niyo po ba balak gamitin ang Suzuki Jimny? Ah, uh, pang kan, opisina. Ah, uh, oh, tapos pang family, kasi naman kasi naman sila dito eh. Oh. Eh, yung pang comfortable siya pang sa tarbaho lang. Okay. Tanong ko lang sir, uh, habang nagmamaneho po kayo, naramdaman niyo po ba yung safety features nung, uh, nung kotse natin? Yes, of course. Okay, okay. Um, Tapos uh, pagdating sa comfort naman, ano po yung pakiramdam habang kayo nagmamaneho aside from the fact na poging pogi yung dating natin? Hindi lang, hindi lang pogi. Uh, sobra. Uh, okay, okay. So ire-recommenda niyo ba ang Suzuki Jimny sa mga ibang tao na naghahanap ng kotse? Yes, siyempre. We have found ourselves a gentleman who test drove a Toyota vehicle. Let's get to know more about this guy. What is your name, sir? Eugene, sir. Eugene, and what vehicle did you choose for your test drive today? Uh, this one, a Cross. Toyota Cross. Toyota, uh, Toyota Corolla Cross, and uh, this is a hybrid vehicle, no? Uh, I, I'd like to, I'd like to know your thoughts on on driving this vehicle. Kamo sa po yung hatak niya, ano yung pakiramdam niyo while driving this vehicle? Actually, uh, second time ko magtest drive ng EV and. So far, napakaganda nung handling niya, ng kanyang arangkada. And uh, as may agent, sabi niya, yung kanyang uh, consumption, yun yung binida rin sa akin. Eh maganda ang concept ng EV vehicle, especially ngayon, na napakamahal ng ano, gasolina. Yeah, 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 I would agree, I would agree. So you enjoy the, no, no, the, the, the power of the vehicle kahit EV siya? Kasi I think that's, uh, that's one of the... Uh, fears of a lot of the uh, motorists out there, yung pagdating sa hybrid or EV vehicle, baka kulang sa bigay ng power, no? Yes. What other features did you enjoy about this car, sir? Actually, yung kanyang dito, na meron siyang uh, sa drive mode, merong eco, merong uh, uh, power for extra, parang sports mode yes. with other brand. So, yun yung tinry ko. So, napakaganda pag eco, especially uh, mas uh, tipid sa gasolina. And yung Power niya naman, pag kailangan mo na ng extra turbo sa arangkata, bigay na bigay actually yung hatak, napaganda. Yun, so far, ganda. Alright, that's good to know. How about safety, sir? Um, how does it feel like driving it, uh, driving the vehicle as far as safety is concerned? Actually, same with uh, other vehicle naman. Wala naman siyang pagkakaiba ron sa normal na sasakyan. Andun yung mga special features niya rin. Meron siyang mga blinker dito, pag may mga dumadaan na sasakyan, makikita mo. So, ngayon, nakikita ko sa mga sasakyan, ano eh, andun na yung, hindi lang yung gagamitin mo siya. Siyempre, five years yan or more na gagamitin. So, yung safety features, andun doon eh, nakalatag na siya. Especially sa family. Right, Yun yung right. tinitingnan natin. Uh -oh. We are now in front of the WM Motor Display and uh, we will be talking to a uh, test driver of one of their vehicles. Good afternoon, sir. What's your name? Nilo Martinez. How, how does it feel like driving a fully electric vehicle? Because this is a fully electric vehicle, right? Okay, naman. Maayos naman. And I like the ride, no? Maganda. 
Uh, Siyempre tahimik, no? Maganda itong, ano, itong WM. So, um, since you were able to take, uh, take, take this uh, vehicle around naman, no? Ano po yung mga nanotice niyong mga parang innovations na that, that made a mark on you while you were driving the car? Siyempre, number one, yung, ano, yung very silent, no? Yun ang ano kasi electric, eh. Well, yung kanyang suspension talagang maganda. Bago, bago sa akin. Pero maganda, maganda. I like it, I like it. We are now with the head of uh, traffic and uh, test drive management, Sir Art. Thank you so much for uh, for, for being here today. So I just need uh, a couple of your uh, insights on uh, what's been happening so far here at the uh, actual ground. So first things first, um, what was our uh, test drive turnout for the for the last four days? Looks like uh, the turnout has been good. Uh, the number of test drivers have been uh, growing since day one. And uh, now, so far, uh, with uh, around two hours to go, uh, we're already about to hit the 1,000 mark. Nice. So hopefully, we expect more people to come and try the cars that are available for test drives. All right, so we noticed that in our uh, test drive festival uh, for, for, for this round, uh, we already have a mix of the, the standard petrol vehicles and uh, we have hybrid vehicles and we have fully electric vehicles that are available for the public. Would you uh, have noticed, sir, kung, uh, kung gaano karami po yung, ano, yung uh, mga test drivers natin na uh, nag-test drive ng mga electric vehicles? Yes, uh, we have data to show that more and more people are getting interested in uh, buying hybrid vehicles, uh, which is indicative that the auto industry is starting to go back as uh, it was before and uh, we have also noticed that many dealers many manufacturers have their own uh, bank partners uh, inside their booths uh, which i learned from some participants that they have already have reservations and uh, and approvals so the market is uh, going back to the way it was before and maybe even better. There were lots of happy faces behind those masked drivers who discovered much to enjoy in the excellent vehicles offered for testing at the festival. We'll wrap up this special when we return after this final break. At the core of Toyota Gazoo Racing lies Motorsports DNA. Combine that with the Philippines' best-selling sedan, you get the Vios GRS. Its black accent details and aero kit upgrade capture the feel and excitement on the track. And the 10-speed CVT that exudes the TGR competitive spirit. On the road or on the track, always be ready for a heart-racing exhilarating ride. The Vios GRS. Bring on the thrill. Welcome back to our special on the Autofocus Pre-Christmas Test Drive Festival. It was indeed quite special as a lot more people came for a visit and a test drive of choice models from the 11 participating brands. It was also special in that participating brands noted a lot more increase as well as actual test drives with solid chances for reservations and actual sales. The festival somehow confirmed predictions of a shift towards greater use of electric vehicles and hybrids may be helping the transition towards an electric era for personal mobility. The festival validated the automaker's view that people are more interested in the SUVs, crossovers, MPVs, vans and pickups than passenger sedans. Before we end this special, we'd like to thank Olson Camacho of Philippine Rallycross Series and Robert Tan of Super Sprint for assisting in the setup and safe management of our test drive facility. We also like to thank our media partners, Philippine Stat and Magic 89.9, for helping make the festival another successful coming together of competing brands and their clientele in one safe and fun venue. Finally, we'd like to thank automotive companies and distributors who trusted us anew with helping them bring them closer to their patrons and clients in this peak season for people gifting them or their families with brand new vehicles. 
I am Ray Louis Gamboa. Thank you all for watching this autofocus special. Have yourself a merry car-filled Christmas.